Good evening. <clears throat> I'm a sports card collector in Southeast Texas, and I was at Target today, and I saw a new form of baseball cards, and I collect baseball cards for some time now. It's a new brand, I believe, Yu-Gi-Oh. You see that there? It's unopened. It uh, hadn't been opened, and it says it has uh, different types of sports cards. Four rares, I'm thinking maybe Kofax, Quebec, Gwen, uh, three foils, hopefully get them magically in there, uh, two booster packs, mm, they could be minor league teams, mm, not sure, two legendary packs, again, maybe a Mattingly, mm, hope so, <coughs> a sealed deck, mm, that sounds interesting, and a storage cube, and this, of course, is a storage cube, so without further ado, we will open this uh, somehow here and see if we can get into <coughs> the goods inside. Well, giving us a little trouble here. But with my trusty knife, uh, I shall get this open, hopefully, <coughs> and find out what is waiting for us inside this uh, cube, the storage cube. So, uh, I see on this side, by the way, there's a Yu-Gi-Oh! sports card called uh, Blue Eyes White Dragon. I'm thinking maybe it's a pack of the Cubs, Blue Eyes White Dragon, the Cubster. I don't know. On the other side, of course, is the um, Invasion of Chaos. I don't recognize a player on the front, but I'm thinking Astros, Invasion of Chaos. Astros are certainly chaos. Let's open it up and see what we get. <clears throat> I have four unusual looking cards. This one evidently may be a Rodriguez. Uh, Tune, ancient. It doesn't look anything like it. Oh, a magical card here. Magical double arm bind. bind. And uh, evidently a first baseman. I don't, I don't understand this card. A roulette spider, again, there's no picture of a player. I'm thinking these are maybe the mascot cards. And I don't recognize these mascots at all. None of these three. Maybe they're post-COVID uh, mascots. Anyway, these might be collector items. Maybe the rookie card of the uh, mascots. Let's get into the packs that are in here. Hopefully I can pull a few Yankees and a few good ones here. Let's open the first pack. Blue Eyes White Dragon. Let's see what holds for us here. I'm a big Yankees fan. I love Joe Morgan. And hopefully I'll get a rookie or maybe a famous card. Who knows? Well, here they are again. Looks like more skull red bird. Another baseball card. Another the legendary swordsman that could be one of these new Donruss elite type cards with the I'm not sure about him. Man eater. Again, two mouth. I don't I don't recognize any of these players. Hain Hain. Evidently uh, that's the young rookie prospect from South side of San Francisco, I believe. Played for the Philadelphia Red Wings in uh, 14 and 15. Anyway, I think that's the only one I recognize. Vile Germs. I don't Petite Angel. Suck of his Knights. I think that is a minor league team. I do recognize them. I don't recognize her, but this could be a good minor league card. And... Kuruma, Kuruma. Well, let's look at the three cards that came inside the packs. Again, I don't, I don't see any resemblance to baseball in these. I could be wrong, but again, I don't know. That could certainly be a Yankee there. Brotherhood of the Fire Fist. That was Quebec and Whitey Ford. They had a, a special friendship. And they kind of come so if the Brotherhoods of the Fist goes after a home run, they would, of course, give that fist pop. 
uh, I'm a little perplexed here. Uh, speakers, break, breakers of shadow. Uh, let's try. Hopefully, we'll get more sports oriented cards because I don't recognize any of these cards. Anyway, Destruction Swordsman. Uh, I don't get it. Uh, oh, here's a good one. Twilight. Twilight Games at the Cubs. Twilight Ninja and the Chair and the Tune-In. Isn't that awesome or what? That could well be two or three hundred dollar or, or less card. Deskbot. 007. Ooh, this is the one we've been looking for. Master Pendulum. This is the one. Now, if you're a sports car collector, you can find this on eBay because I'm going to list this later. I'm not sure which player it is, but I'll try to find that out. I'm not sure which team he's on. Twilight Ninja. I think that's a Cleveland Indian. Super Heavy Samurai. Atlanta. Duh. Yeah. Maybe. Ooh, Twilight Ninja again. Again, the Cleveland Indians. Al Lumi. Hodge. I'm thinking Nolan Ryan. Nolan Ryan, certainly. Raj. Or Roger. Nolan Ryan. Forbidden Apocrypha. Is that awesome or what? Okay. Have two more decks and a, some kind of sealed thing here. Okay. Hopefully I'll get me a Mattingly in one of these last two packs. That's my hope. Stealth Bird. Falcons. Got a football card in here, folks. Sea Serpent Warrior of Darkness. Boston Red Sox. I'm thinking Ortiz there. He's kind of hard to figure these out because I've never seen any cards like these. Balloon Lizard. Minnesota Lizards. Minnesota Twins Lizards. Again, that might be Herbic, maybe, or, or Puckett. I'm not sure. Yellow Luster Shield, uh, we know that. Oklahoma City Thunder. <laughs> oh, maybe that's basketball. Robin Zombie. Robin. Gotham City, New York. I don't recognize the guy, though. Neobug, okay. Neobug was a original mascot of the Oakland A's back in 63-64. And I happen to know this, being kind of like a guru, but it looks nothing like the one Neobug I remember. <coughs> Salvage, again the Astros. Salvage this year. Silt feed. Silt heed. Mm. No need to say anything about that one. That's evident. And recycle. Again, the Astros. Recycle this year. <coughs> Our last pack. We've been doing pretty well so far. Hope that again my luck continues. And uh, maybe get that Mattingly I'm looking for. Uh, oh, ooh. Monster Egg. We know that one to be true. Buffalo Bills. Monster Egg, five times in the Super Bowl. I remember that. Lesser Dragon. Lesser Two Beebles. Derek Jeter. Alex Rodriguez. Must be Derek Jeter. Petite Dragon. That's kind of like a large, large bird. Now it looks like a falcon. You can see the resemblance. Yes. I think that's Atlanta Falcons. Uh, Dale Murphy, maybe. Mystical Elf. Now that could be my favorite card of the night. Of the night, Mystical Elf. We see the word elf and we think small. We think small. We think Cleveland Indians. So it's probably maybe LeBron. I'm not sure. Grave Digger Ghoul. You've been wondering where that was going to come from. And there it is, folks. New Orleans Pelicans. Grave Digger Ghoul. Zion Williamson, Grave Digger Ghoul. Anyway, 
I really don't recognize any of these players. Kagimusha. I think he's in uh, came from Japan. He led the league in hitting the last seven years. 369, 374, and 411 over Japan. This is his first year over here, but that looks nothing like him. Dragon Treasure. Uh, again, this is probably the Mets. Indeed, they are a treasure. They're a wonder. And they're a lot of dragon around. Kumutoku. Uh, that's a Philippines player. Originally from China. Came to Philippines. Uh, we'll put on waivers. Picked up by the White Sox, I believe, in a trade for Joey Bell some years ago. But there's nothing like him. Beaver Warrior. And uh, if you're a fan, fan of the Warriors, you know this year has been a Beaver Warrior. You know, a lot of small Warriors running around. Did not cut the mustard. Except for Kyle Bowman. He might be the one. Now, the only thing we have left is this deck. I'm not going to open that because uh, this could be worth something like it is. Anyway, that's the uh, Yogi, Yogi -Oh new uh, trading card that just came out. Got them at Target. And if you're interested, these will be posted on eBay later on tonight. Maybe, maybe not. But anyway, again, this is the Sports Guru from Southeast Texas. Wishing you a good and happy night. Be well.